Battery failure can be broken down into three primary areas, heat, vibration, and lack of maintenance. Let's look at these conditions in more detail and discuss what you can do to prevent failure. The leading cause is heat. Most of us experience battery issues when the temperature is low, which leads us to conclude it's the cold that causes the problem. But this failure actually began in the heat of the preceding summer. In high heat climates, the battery's electrolyte will evaporate. This is known as gassing. Evaporation of water leads to a high acid concentration and low electrolyte volume. If the fluid level drops significantly, the damage becomes irreversible. Corrosion of the grids inside the battery is also accelerated with heat. Another leading cause of battery failure is vibration. Vibration can occur as the equipment is driven over rough terrain. Over time, the positive material on a plate can shed, increasing resistance, reducing capacity, leading to reduced battery life. Severe prolonged vibration can lead to broken welds of the plates. If the vibration is too severe, an internal short can occur if the positive and negative plates make contact. When replacing a battery, look for one with higher vibration resistance, such as the John Deere Strongbox batteries. While there is not a lot you can do to prevent the first two causes of battery failure, there are steps you can take to prevent the third leading cause, lack of maintenance. An important maintenance step is to simply periodically check the fluid level in your battery cells. When the water level is low, recharging becomes less efficient, leading to irreversible damage and premature battery failure. If the fluid level is low, simply add distilled water until the plates are covered. Understanding the causes of battery failure will help you identify the steps you can take to provide years of effective service.